Mass News is getting you answers. Good evening, everyone. On this Friday, I'm Chris Pisano. Oh, we begin with a story you'll see only here on Western Mass News. I'm Jordan Jagelinzer. Stuart Weldon, the Springfield man accused of murdering three women and hiding their bodies on his property, appearing before a judge in a virtual hearing this morning. Now the brother of one of those victims is speaking out on the length of time it is taking for the courts to try this case. Western Mass News reporter Audrey Russo is live for us in Springfield with the exclusive details. Audrey. The court acknowledged just how long it's taken for this case to make its way through the system. But for the families who are waiting for Weldon's day in court, they say closure has taken far too long. Mr. Weldon, would you state your full name, please? Oh, Weldon. All right. Good morning, Mr. Weldon. Good morning, Judge. Stuart Weldon calmly answering the judge during his video conference hearing Friday morning. This is the latest court appearance in a case Western Mass News has been following for almost three years. Weldon was arrested in 2018 and charged with 52 counts. Among the serious are the kidnapping and murdering of three women along with rape charges. He pleaded not guilty to all the counts. During the hearing, the judge asked about Weldon's ability to stand trial. Is there anything in those reports that would suggest that uh, Mr. Weldon uh, would not be competent for trial. No, you are. The lawyers on both sides discussed an October trial date. Although the judge acknowledged the pandemic's role in slowing the court system, he ordered a June 28th status update rather than setting an October trial date right then and there. So this is an important case. It's an older case, and I do want to get it uh, tried. We would wait. We've been waiting to try to. Get some closure. For Anthony Ryan's, October is a long time to wait to get justice for his sister Ernestine. Her body was one of three found on Weldon's property. I would hope going forward that yeah, there's something that can be done to try to expedite the process because it is grueling for the family. Again, the judge set a June 28th hearing for a status update and to determine whether or not to set an October trial date. Live in Springfield, Audrey Russo. For Western Mass News.